everyone knows Gwen, like everybody. <laughs> so that's that's sort of the way that she is. And okay, I have that disappointment. No matter how hard you try, perfect. You won't find another person with more zest for life than Gwen Franson. I just wanted to be me. I wanted to show them that it's okay and you can be yourself. Her bubbly personality is infectious and the six-year-old's electric smile radiates positivity, which helps the little girl from Farmville living with a life-altering condition. It was not very tough, but it was strange. Two years ago, Gwen's mom, Catherine, recognized some troubling changes. And I noticed that she had a big bald spot on top of her head. First, it was my eyebrows, and then it started getting on my head. A doctor diagnosed Gwen with alopecia. It kind of is hard to, to deal with it because you're just different than the others, and you Sometimes you just feel embarrassed. So it was hard to get any information that is, your kid's not 100% healthy. Alopecia it's is an autoimmune condition really that attacks healthy hair follicles, which leads to baldness. Well, I just think she's beautiful, no matter what. There is no known cure. I mostly see all of myself in her. The adjustment's been great. Like, she she just has handled it completely smoothly. Despite the occasional stare from strangers, Gwen's friends and classmates remain supportive. She knows that, that she looks a little bit different from others, and yet she embraces it, and she makes it not a big deal. And then he turns back. She's going to succeed very well. L. Franson says the diagnosis has not changed her little sister one bit. Good job. She can lose all her hair and still just being her normal self. I think that's very impressive. So she's energetic. She's full of life. She's happy. She's fun. Dad um, Adam says you know, like his daughter her. handles her condition with ease. Gwen's going to run with it. She's going to be fantastic. She's going to grow up and achieve whatever it is that she wants to achieve. Being an ambassador for alopecia is a role Gwen readily accepts. She's so bold with her baldness. She's not interested in covering it up. Gwen is such an inspiration to me. Oh, and there we are at Hollywood Studios. A big Star Wars fan with a soft spot for Darth Vader. Yeah, we did Jedi. You guys did Jedi training. Gwen is using her force for good, educating anyone and everyone oh, about her disease. That was a good face painting day. I don't want to wear a wig. I don't want to cover it up. I want to show people that I am, I am bald and I am brave. She is a child rolling and laughing through life. She'll say, well, maybe, maybe somebody else will be brave because, because I'm being brave. I wish I could be as courageous. Gwen Franson may have lost her hair, but certainly didn't lose her spot. I can do whatever I did when I had hair. It didn't stop me from doing anything I wanted to. Miss Gwen will be wrapping up first grade here in the coming months. This summer, she has big plans. She'd like to attend an alopecia camp and also learn how to swim. For Heroes Among Us, I'm Greg McQuaid, CBS 6 News.